Hi guys, this is part of Miscellaneous Mondays. What are we having for dinner tonight? Chicken Caesar salad. Let me show you, show you how I do that. So I got my chicken going. I cut it in little bite-sized pieces. I'm going to put some garlic powder on it. I'm going to put some salt and pepper on it. Mixed seasoning. I'm going to season up my chicken and then I'll show you what I do next. Okay, while the chicken is browning, I mixed up the Caesar salad. It comes with the lettuce, Parmesan cheese, and the dressing. I mixed up everything but the croutons because I don't like for them to get mushy. And because I don't like the big chunky hearts, I actually sit down at the table and chop the hearts into smaller pieces so they're not so crunchy. And so it's more like a chopped Caesar salad on part of it. Doesn't that look delicious? This is one of my semi-healthy meals that I make. All right, looks like the chicken's done. Okay, I got the Caesar salad plated. The chicken is done. Now I'm gonna add some croutons on the top. I like to add them at the end so it's they stay nice and crunchy. This is just a nice, uh, simple, decently healthy meal to serve your family. Here's some of the chicken. And I like the chicken bite size so you get a little bite of the chicken with a bite of the salad, with a bite of the croutons. This is what they look like. What do you think, guys? It's a good meal. I love it. Crunchy, yummy, filling. And you can side this with a piece of bread or crackers if you're not trying to watch your weight. And when I get full-blown into my diet, I don't put the croutons on. I put walnuts instead of the croutons. And so this is the meal. What's for dessert? Chocolate cupcakes with funfetti icing. Yum, yum, yum. This is what we're having for dessert tonight. I can't wait to try one. Have a blessed day. Hi, guys. It's Gail with Gail Southern Living. So today we went to Tractor Supply and we got the stuff for the chickens, for the chicken food. And the bill came to $149 and change. And we got $10 off for the rewards. And then we got more off on two free coupons that I got for some cat stuff. So uh, we went from, we got eight bags for $149 and change and then we got all that off and it came to 104 and change after that so that's a pretty good amount of savings so here is what we put in our chicken feed whole corn whole oats alfalfa pellets black oil sunflower seeds organic layer feed and a dog food for the protein so that's what that's the five bags of what we put in ours and we do this uh, we do the alfalfa and the corn in the summer mostly so this is what we feed our chickens um, I first heard of this type of uh, mixture from Becky's homestead and I will put her link in the description box. This is her original recipe. But these are the five bags we put in there for our chickens. So this is what we feed our chickens. What do you feed your chickens? Do you feed them anything different? Occasionally they get table scraps, vegetable scraps in the summer. Um, they also get um, mealworms occasionally when we have them. And uh, a few other things. Pumpkin all kinds of different things from the garden. So you guys have a great day. 
be blessed. Do something kind, guys. Hi, this is Gail with Gail Southern Living. I am going to start the prep for this small garden bed. This is the next one on my list. So I have prepared a container of vinegar water. And I am putting this down to help with the weeds. Help with the weed situation for next year. Okay, so I put down that. Uh, so the next thing I'm going to put down is a layer of cardboard. Now it looks like I need to cut that one to go over or get one more piece for right there. But I want to cover all this area with cardboard to keep the weeds out. Molly wanted to come say hi. So this is my first two steps, uh, vinegar water and cardboard. 